Hey guys, it's Jag. Welcome back to the arcade and welcome back to my voice. Let's get back to just another game, Slide 2 Band of Thieves. And it feels so good to be able to talk again and also be playing a Sly again because last time we finally were able to bust him out of prison. Now we need to work on getting Murray out, but uh, before we do that I have a little bit of bad news. Apparently because we didn't actually go to the safe house last time, it did not save the bottles that we collected. So we kind of wasted a bunch of time collecting those five bottles, but that's okay because we're going to get we're going to get the bottles again in a more organized, less panicky manner. Starting with these two. This one that Bentley actually collected, we're going to take credit for that. And this one that this guard is guarding, we're going to take that. Um, I haven't decided if I'm going to do 10 bottles this episode or 15 because technically we haven't started a job yet so I'll see how that plays out but I have at least planned on the bottles that we are going to get heading back to the safe house to reunite with Bentley and I have drawn up plans for the rest of the bottles in this in the map so it shouldn't be too hard to find them all Unless I keep getting guards on my tail. Guards, guards everywhere are not a piece to be had. Alright, so we need to get that one. And then, let's see here. Should be one over there across the way. I'm not seeing it yet, though. Oh! Okay, I missed, but I didn't miss as badly as I could have. Unfortunately, that means that you saw me. Yeah, there it is. We just saw it briefly. Right there. That's our fifth bottle. Cool. I knew I had scudded it properly. But uh, this one here. This one gave us some trouble last episode too. There we go. That got it. I just need to move across hopefully without getting caught by another guard. Please no more guards. Please. I just want to like get the loot and go home. There we go. Okay, now to the safe house. To officially end the mission, apparently. And, you know, save. Because apparently it didn't save. Until this. Okay, here's the situation. I've done some deep database crunching and figured out that Murray is doing time in cell block D. Getting him out is going to be tough. As you know, he's not very light on his feet. <laughs> First, we'll need to get Murray into an isolation cell away from the other inmates. Second, I'll need you to get a sample of the Contessa's encryption algorithm. Don't worry, I'll explain later. Third, you'll need to pickpocket a few keys from the Contessa, but watch out for her pack of bodyguards. And fourth, You'll have to deactivate her giant attack robot. No, really, Sly, I'm serious. The Contessa has a giant attack robot. It just looks like a water tower. Now, once you've pulled off all these jobs, we'll be ready to make a play for the big guy. So yeah, obviously we're not going to be playing as Murray for this episode, not? Well, I take that back. We actually will play as him in a few limited scenarios, but uh, he won't have that many opportunities. In fact, I think we may only be playing him uh, playing as him once. But now that the train is out of commission, we actually kind of have free reign over the tracks, which is good. And I want to go ahead and start getting this bottle that we can hear from inside the safe house. If the blue sparklies will cooperate. Oh, dude, that's cool. You can see where we're sitting and you can see the ThiefNet computer and everything. Oh, I never noticed that before. That's really awesome. It doesn't look like our safe house has glass, so we're probably cold as hell since this is Prague. But it's cool that you can see inside. All right, now the next bottle is along the wire for a ways. It's actually going to be right there. Oh, good. You, you Sly, uh, please Sly, there, please do not fall down and make me have to go back, 
we're basically going to collect five bottles that are all along the tracks here. Most of them are going to be up top. And, uh, they're pretty simple to get. I actually really like this part of the level now that the train's not running and trying to kill me. There's that one. Now we got two more. I might actually do 15 bottles this episode just to make up for the fact that it did not save the first five that we get or that we got, including the one that Bentley got. Which I am kind of okay with because I was not happy with how we were collecting bo damn it, collecting bottles that episode at all. I did not feel like that was even remotely close to a good approach. So I'm not too torn up that it did not save because it gave me time to sit down with a map, scout things out, really organize things in a much more linear manner instead of running all over the map trying to break them as I saw them because if you do that in your playthrough wow I'm glad I missed that um that is literally the best way to ensure that you spend a ton of time bottle hunting you really need to organize how you collect your bottles and what your approach is because if you go at it all willy-nilly, you will miss a bottle, you won't realize where it was, and then you will be very, very annoyed. Alright. I believe that's the last one for now. So where is our next mission? I think I want to tail the Contessa. Yeah, this should be over here. Sly has a lot of work to do. Sly has a ton of work to do. I mean, it makes sense because, like I said, you're not going to be playing as Murray anytime soon. There it is. Oh, tanks coming, tanks coming, tanks coming, tanks coming. But, and Bentley already had his moment to shine, so yeah. Now Sly is doing all the legwork while Bentley plans. But it's just funny to see like four or five Sly jobs, you know, all clustered together. Also, I feel like this might actually be kind of one of the shorter episodes. I don't remember for sure. We'll find out. Oh, I missed. It's to put me back where I wanted to be. I'll get you soon, my pretty. You won't escape me for too long. Sly. 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 Really? Alright, how am I supposed to get there? <laughs> Uh, okay. There, like that. Get at Murray. I'll need you to steal two tank keys and the tank patrol schedule off of the Contessa. No problem. I'm an old hand at pickpocketing. This is going to be tougher than you think. The Contessa's no fool. Since your escape, she never goes anywhere without bodyguards. You'll have to take them out one by one in order to get close to her. We should probably use noise to lure them away from the Contessa. I could do that. Or I could just make them disappear. Alright, that last one's a spotlight. It's not a guard. Okay, are you holding anything on a pickpocket? No, goodbye. This is so easy. Now that we have the electric cane. That guy only knows that his friend's coins were left behind. And now he's next. Of course, it is a little bit difficult to catch up with him when he's trying to catch up with the Contessa. And this is not the only time we will have to pickpocket. Oh, she heard me. How did she hear me? She turned around way too fast. All right, maybe I do need to make some noise for this guy just because he's so close. So I can take out this guy silently. And then I might just, you know, use the noise that that guy made. To take out him! Ah, 
she came back to investigate. I like how she looks just like, ah, you. How dare you, sir? All right, third time's the charm. I cannot keep screwing this up. That got it. I don't need you setting off the alarm either. Oh god, she's coming back. No, there she is. Okay, good. So yeah, we've got to do this three times. Maybe I was getting a little bit overconfident. You don't know. It It's certainly like it's never happened before. No, not at all. Not me. Come on. This one's actually kind of hard to... Huh? judge because of her giant ass really really is this really happening right now okay now I am kind of annoyed Did you just like crap spiders at me? This will be easy, he said. Failing it five times in a row? Oh no, I can do this. I got this stupid electric cane and crap. I'm gonna jump in this barrel. Barrel time. Did she hear that? She didn't hear that. Okay. That worked out better. Now let's see if I... I like how she feels perfectly safe walking on these tracks now that the train is gone. Let's see if I can judge the swaying of her butt. Maybe this camera angle will help. Nope. Come on. Doesn't help the Got it. Who goes there? Huh? Where Where are my gods? And somehow she doesn't see me. Now. Okay. One down, finally. Good lord. Where am I going next? I'll use this to gain a vantage point. Hello, bottles. I will come back for you another time. Where does she go? Alright, there she is. Being in your own prison won't help you. I can go anywhere. I can do anything. I am Sly Master Thief Cooper. Yes. Twirl my mustache and such. All right, now she has three guards. Uh, avoid the minigun turrets. All we'll really need to do is worry about the guard that's closer to her. That's the one where positioning is really going to make a difference, as we have discovered. Oh man, for someone who didn't have a voice in that last episode, I have an amazing Ric Flair impression. <laughs> just suddenly like, train's coming, train, I just had a sense the train was coming. And, uh, okay, that worked. 
I just had the sense the train was coming and I could feel it on my back and so when I see that flash go by out of the corner of my eye as I jump out of the way that was amazing all right there's number two they're gone again yeah I made them disappear all right she still has one more item where did she go this time I think she's gonna have like four guards now maybe five Ah, she's over there. You know what? I have this present for you. There you go. I hope you enjoy it. Okay. You also want a present. Enjoy. How am I going to get over there? I guess breaking out the same way that I did before? Through the train? Seems like a plan. I like how she never replaced the guards with motion controls. Nah, they're all dead. Well, no reason to replace them now. Alright. Can she see me up here? I really hope not, because she's coming this way. Alright, good. How many guards we got? Just the three. Okay. Just the three guards. I can handle that. But they are going through a more populated area. That's going to be the challenge here. Not getting spotted by the other guards. Come on. Nobody's here. Nobody's here. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. You're all fine here. How are you? You're dead. Alright, now they're all the way over there. I do think that you can't let them get too far away or you will also fail the mission. Oh no! Run away. Contessa's coming. Uh, she saw me! Do I at least have a checkpoint? Please tell me I have a checkpoint. For the love of God, give me a checkpoint. Thank you, Jesus. And she's back on the train again. Huh. You know, you probably should have some guards in front of you, too. Or also to the sides. Not just behind. But, you know, whatever. Oh man, definitely uh, got lucky there. Let's see if I can lure him out by running. Here we go. Probably should pickpocket him, but I just want to get this job done. Alright, where is she? She didn't hear that, did she? Nope, there she is. All alone. Unprotected. From me! A raccoon. In a blue suit. Joink! Where are those lazy bodyguards? They're all fired. <laughs> they should be so now lucky. All set up to steal <laughs> Spider legs. Okay. So I think I will go snag five more barrels as or bottles. Why do I keep calling them barrels? Five more bottles as quick as I can. And then we're going to do one more job and call it an episode. So this might go slightly long, but it shouldn't be too bad. To be fair, I shouldn't have taken that long to do that pickpocketing job. I don't know why I failed at that constantly. I'm so bad at this. Elpier's Curse? I, can I claim that? Is that a thing? Do you have to have a certain amount of Let's Plays under your belt before you're allowed to uh, call that? I don't know. 
But we're gonna head into the prison to get our next five balls. Balls? I'm never gonna say this right. Bottles! Why do I have such a hard time with certain words? It's only certain words. Reward, bottles, um, I've noticed that I sometimes have a little bit of difficulty with the phrase treasure chest. Okay. Just taking a quick look here. I think I want this one. Let's see. I think I actually passed one I want to. Oh no, there it is. I see it. I want that one. I want that one over there on the wire. No, actually I don't. I don't want that one on the wire yet. I do want this one under here though. Good luck finding me, dude. And then I want that one on the fence. That's the one I want. I'm just wait for you to calm down a little bit so that I can move the camera to help me out more. Nobody heard a thing. Especially you, man who's about to die before you set off the alarm. Okay, where next? That one there. Right over the main gate. Yep, that's the one I want. And then there should be one on top of a roof. And that should actually pretty much do it. Yep, there's the one on the roof. Uh, okay, how do I want to get up there? That might be a little bit tricky. And then we're going to do a code capture, because I actually kind of like code capture. Code capture is one of the fun missions. If you know where you're, what you're doing, where you're going, and how to do it. You know, like everything else that I fail at. How do we get up there? Just like this. This is not the roof I wanted to be on. That one is. Say, okay, so we're gonna play the game again. How do I get up there? Ah. All the way over here, you say. Don't fall off. Okay. Not what I expected. How to get on top of that thing. Also, there was a guard here. For some reason, he was not here when I made my escape. And now, I am the pains. Alright, am I stuck in here now? Yeah, I'm stuck in here. Crap. Alright. That kind of ruined it a little bit. All right, I need to use the hook to get out of here like I've already had to do twice. Pay attention, me. Grab the hook, Sly. All right, what's the easiest way back into, to break back into jail? It's a darn good question, actually. Now this kind of set me back, didn't it? Yeah, it did. Really? I hit you. I call shenanigans. Also, I call running. <sighs> running! Oh god, lid behind him. Thank you. I needed that health. Thank you. Sir, may I have more? More is good. go all the way back and around oh man did not think that I was gonna get set back this bad whoops now uh, this is gonna be a longer episode there's nothing I can do about it now I've made a commitment I'm going to see the commitment through 
no matter how long it takes. I need to get one more bottle, and I need to do another job, because that's what I said I was going to do. And no matter what, even if I don't manage to do much, I always try to keep on the schedule that I say in an episode. Even if I if I say it in an episode, I consider that like sigh. There. Um, I consider that pretty much a promise to do at least that. No matter how long it takes. I really do not like there's treasure here. Changing my scenario or changing my schedule once I've set it. You guys realize whenever I have to delay an episode or anything like that, I feel absolutely freaking terrible about it. Like this delay here where I lost my voice, I actually had to go back and forth with myself for about a half an hour trying to decide if I could record any of the episodes or if I was going to have to absolutely give up. And um, I know that seems silly, but that's how seriously I take my commitments to you guys. I really do. Oh, wait. Is this how I get up here? This is how I get up here. There we go. Hey, right, get on there. Awesome. Now we can go up here and get this bottle. But yeah, I hate having to delay things. I really do. Alright, code capture's over there. Every time I do it, I'm like, God, I feel like I just had to m let people know that an episode's gonna be delayed. But, look, I mean, what can I do? My voice, I was already kind of risking a really bad episode by not having my voice Why? I need before. your help getting a handle on the Contessa's encryption algorithm. I'd love to, pal, but I have no idea what you're talking about. All right, I'll explain it to you one piece at a time. See that security station? The guard nearby is responsible for its upkeep. I'm with you. First, I'll need you to pickpocket his key to the terminal. Sure, no problem. Then use it on the security station to set off the alarm. Hold up. You want me to set off the alarm? Yeah, set it off, then clear out as the guard's sure to come running. Once he sees that it's a false alarm, he'll input the code to turn it off. So you want me to take a picture of the code? Move to a safe place and get a clean shot of that digital readout. Should I hit all the security stations out here? That's right. Once I've got a large enough sample of the Contessa's codes, I should be able to crack her encryption algorithm. Now, see, you lost me again. Just take the pictures. I'll handle the rest. Yeah, I was already kind of risking a bad episode with Wednesday's episode, but I did not want to keep it, keep delaying it. And it was the right decision to not try to record while I didn't have my voice. Nice work. Now use that but I still felt incredibly station. guilty about it. Alright. First, I want to make sure I know the fastest way back up and then there you go all right let's do it okay now climb to a good spot where you'll be able to get a picture of the security code on the you monitor. don't have too much time to do this so you kind of want to scout out as best as you can and you're gonna need one where you get a full shot of the digital readout this one's fairly simple, but after a while they get much more difficult. There we go, there's one. Still, this is kind of fun. I, I definitely like this approach to, or this job. This is really cool. All right, where is the next closest one that I'm not gonna get shot? Oh wait, that doesn't exist because this is prison and guns are everywhere. Oh, uh, the remaining three are all outside? Okay. Maybe. That one might be inside. No, that one's just outside. Okay. So we don't need to be in the prison anymore. I should pickpocket you. 
I've let my pickpocketing go, even though I'm in the middle of a job and I know I need to get this done. Money's money. You did not give me any health, you jerk. Alright, where is this one? Okay. You also have some interesting platforming challenges to get some of these done. I'm actually going to have to approach from the other side, I think, and then lure you away with noise. This one might be one of the more challenging ones. There's one where you have to take a picture literally hanging from a hook. that one. Now how do we get back up? Okay, that bell will be how we lure him away from the station. And then we're going to have to take a picture from here? No, we're going to need to get a little further away. Right here. Alright, there we go. Need to set this off. Okay, here we go. Perfect. Two more like that, and we're done. I do like the one where you have to take a picture hanging from a hook. That's kind of cool. Mm, no guns. How did you see me? No, really, you shouldn't have. Also, you killed me. Two does, or several does in one episode, but... At least we're given checkpoints, God. The elephant mission where you don't have a checkpoint and I kept f and I failed on it right as I um, got to the final gym. God, that was fun. Everybody enjoyed that, especially not me. Is there one closer than the one way over there? No. One way over there. Okay. Yes, we're headed for the one way over there. Let's uh, not get. Sh Do you hurt me? Yes. Okay. Thought you did. Set it just out. I was right. Fantastic. I love proving myself right when I get damaged. Okay. Where is this one again? Right there. Two guards. He reacted to that late. And he misses a patrol! Oh man. Bat, you are in the wrong place at the very wrong time. This might be the one where I hang from a hook. I'm going to need to remember where this alarm is. Okay, it's right here. And the digital readout... The digital readout is right there. Yeah, here we go. This is what you have to do. Okay. Now let me let me out. I'm gonna set this off when he's at his furthest. 
patrol. Because this guy's actually pretty diligent. And he will come check it out very quickly. Got it, somehow. <laughs> Sly swinging did not help. I don't know how Bentley's gonna get anything out of that picture, but whatever, we got it, we don't care. It's his problem. He said to leave the rest to him. That's exactly what we're gonna do. Okay, now we need to get back across the bridge. See, I knew I was going to set off at least one or two stealth guards along the way. That's why I didn't really care about being sneaky. Okay. Last one. This one should be easier than the other two. As soon as I can find it. Alright, there's the readout. There's the guard. Uh, what's the fastest way up here? It's a damn good question, actually. Can I read it from the lamppost? That would be the best outcome, but I don't think that's going to work. You know what? We're going to battle over here. I really, really do not like the ambushers. It's really dumb how you can get screwed just without even realizing it. Okay. V patrols all the way around. He's going to come back this way. Right, he's going to go back toward that corner. And I'm going to run all the way around. Right there. Let's go. get a good shot of it. Where am I supposed to look? Not there. Just here? No, oh, he saw me because I was kind of dumb. What angle am I supposed to use here, game? Am I supposed to use that hook again? Let's see, let's check this out this time. Cause he got there fast. Yeah, I think the hook. Yep, all right. That's gonna be a hell of a run. Man, this episode's already 40 minutes long, wow. Okay, well, should be wrapping up in a couple of minutes.
really hate putting out these super long episodes. Probably should not have gone for 15 bottles. Won't do that again. Come on. Damn it. Why do you have to be so good at your job? Well, I'm not getting it this time. Why isn't this angle good enough? It is funny that uh, he's probably getting sick of responding to that alarm though. Take it! No! Uh. <laughs> God. I thought this was going to be the easiest one. Man, was I wrong? I got no words. I'm just trying to get this done. Sorry. Yeah, like, commentary's gone. I just want to get this last thing done. Why is this one so difficult? Why do you need a close up? Alright. I'm on the verge of saying that we're going to do this on the next episode. I feel like I'm doing something wrong and I'm not sure exactly what it is. Oh! A sly hadn't. That might have been it. That might have been the trick here. Maybe I need to get all the way to that platform. Oh man, I hope that's it. I hope that's it. Please let that be it. I want to be done with this. Also, I'm like really hungry. <laughs> I'm doing this before dinner. Oh, that was it. All right, we're going to call it a very long episode here, guys. Thanks for coming out and watching today. If you enjoyed it, make sure to let me know by leaving me that thumbs up. And uh, if you're new to the channel and you want to see more Sly, subscribe, because I upload every weekday. And if you have any comments, leave one below. Thanks for coming out and watching today. I've always appreciated it, and you guys have a great day. Bye.